Hi everyone, um, it's good to be back. Uh, it's gonna be a quick like five, 10 minute video, uh, just a life update. I know I've been gone for a while. The last video I posted, I was in Seychelles and I was talking about how many videos I wanna post. So I obviously didn't do that. Um, I've been really busy traveling, studying, so I'm just going to take you through what I've been busy with. So Feb, I moved to Cape Town, started my new job, March, April, uh, studying May, I wrote 8213 or life contingencies and I failed spectacularly. <laughs> June, I got the results back and I started studying again a bit. Um, yeah, I think or July. And then in July, I brought my parents here. I spent some time in Big Bay. I loved it. I absolutely loved it. Um, I love the West Coast in general. Uh, in May, I'd also been to Tali Tali. So that's sort of where I got exposure to the West Coast. I spent a weekend glamping there. Loved it, loved it. And then my parents were here for like uh, five days. My, yeah. My parents, my, my cousin and my niece. And yeah, we had the time of our lives. Then July, yeah, that was July, August, I'm still studying. September, I'm still studying. Um, October, I wrote, so I wrote 7th October. Um, I felt confident this time. I felt confident about the work, book work. I felt confident about Excel. So yeah, I'm telling you guys so that you can look me up on the past list this semester. I'm also thinking, what am I writing next? Like what's after life contingencies? Like I'm very scared to write models, 812, and I'm very scared to write 8214, which is, uh, uh, you know, financial engineering. So I don't know. Um, I also don't have stats, so 811. So I could do stats and I could do um, comms. So just check down below and let me know, because I've had comms notes since 2023 and I just, yeah. So let me know in the comments below, like what comes after 8213, naturally, um, if you're on the XI journey. And then I'm in asset management. So something that I realized I'm passionate about is just knowledge sharing. And that was the vision behind, I think, this kind of platform. I think, um, yeah, life just got in the way. But essentially we had a CFA day of the girl or girl of the day. And we had a bunch of, uh, you know, young people from high schools coming in and shadowing and then learning more about asset management and the investment industry and the opportunities in it. And I just realized like so many people don't know um, about, you know, the opportunities here, especially people that come from a disadvantaged background, because it's not every day that you get exposure to this type of thing. So it really is something that I want us to nurture and if you have you know direct questions then it's something i'd be more than happy to to you know assist with um yeah like it's very hard to answer broad questions but if it's something that's more direct then open to answering but also it mustn't be something that you can get an answer for online so when is ect applications opening um that that's the kind of information that you should self-help but if you're asking, look, I don't fully understand the difference between a BSc and a BCom, that's the type of thing that I can whip up my camera, start a, a video on, and hopefully other people can also benefit from that. So I do want to be more deliberate about this channel, where it's going, what it's tackling. Um, but yeah, but studies are always gonna come first, work is always going to come also, you know, first. So, this is secondary, it is a passion project, but it is something that I want to be more consistent in. So yeah, then in terms of travels, I've got a camping trip coming up this Friday. I've got a camping trip to Tsitsikama in November. Then I've got a camping trip in December. I want to always be traveling on my birthday. It's something that I experienced for the first time last year. I went on a solo trip to the Seychelles, as you know, and I absolutely loved it. I To go is to see, and to see is to learn. And yeah, I'm all about learning. I like the self-discovery that comes with, you know, solo trips. 
and yeah it's something that i'm always going to be pushing until i can obviously find a worthy plus one um so yeah so i'm going camping titikama in november end october i'm going camping somewhere i'll tell you after i'm gone obviously just for safety and then in december it's a botswana and zimbabwe trip um i've got the transport there <laughs> but i haven't booked transport back so i don't know if you're in zim can you drive me back home or whatever um so those are the trips i have and then i saw mr how much the real mr how much went to brazil so i'm really considering like i know i, I said i do africa but like brazil looks really good it looks really similar to south africa i think i'd be happy there i think i'd like the food i think i'd like the people so i don't know for next year maybe and then i'm also thinking very hard about what's happening next semester what am i doing like i said is it a212 is it comms and stats is it just comms is it just stats so i've got a lot to think on and i've been meeting a lot of people in you know my line of work and a lot of handshaking I, i'd hope we would be done with that after covid but yeah people still insist a lot of handshaking a lot of people that i went to uni with of like coming coming back into the fold which is really exciting it's really exciting and then i'm also meeting like new new people which is also quite you know exciting um the market is small but the market is big so it's always nice seeing a familiar face in a room full of you know unknown really tall men um yeah and i hope we do get more representation in the industry so that you don't feel lost when you're walking in um in a room full of you know people that don't look like you or don't sound like you um but yeah it's it's an exciting journey that i'm on and i'm really pumped to be back at the beach i'm taking swimming lessons we're going to get into surfing um yeah so i just want to build my confidence a bit more so i'm excited <laughs> uh, i'm gonna end the video here i think it's enough of an update